Now, let's go to Jay McCauley with information on the district junk food ban. Jay? Junk food, where did it go? It can't be found here, but it can be found in the cafeteria. At the beginning of the summer, all soda in the vending machines were changed to diet. Drink choices have moved towards sports drinks and water due to a district mandate. Although made with good intentions, the removal of soda from vending machines has made a negative impact on student council's funds. Having collected money from the Breezeways machines since 1995, student council raises $3,000 a month. This has had an adverse effect upon the revenue that we receive. That money comes into student council, then student council then distributes to clubs and other organizations on campus. With this change in soda machines, the estimated revenue per month is now up in the air, leaving the funds student council doles out to clubs in jeopardy. This mandate makes little sense on the surface, as individuals can still purchase soda in the cafeteria. Junk food ban, fighting obesity one calorie at a time. I'm Jay McCauley, reporting for CDS-TV.